She intentionally let a snake bite her baby. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jamison Euler. And I'm Wendy Ryan. Thanks for joining us. Highlands County deputies now investigating this Facebook video. New at 6, ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith reveals the reason she did it. Beware here, the video may be hard for some of you to watch. A Facebook video causing quite the firestorm online. Tonight, the mother at the center of it all, defending her decision to put a red rat snake face to face with her one year old daughter. A teachable moment or dangerous lesson. My intent was never to hurt her. The mother behind this now controversial Facebook video is speaking out only to ABC Action News. It had bitten me and my son and didn't leave a mark several times, so I thought it was a good opportunity to introduce her without actually getting hurt. We've confirmed the Highlands County Sheriff's Office is investigating what happened. We are not identifying this mother because deputies have not charged her with a crime. In the video, the one-year-old reaches into the plastic box, then the snake strikes. <laughs> She says the baby was not hurt, only scared of the snake's movement. His teeth are too small to actually puncture the skin, so he's very harmless. Living on an isolated nine acres on the outskirts of Sebring, this mother tells me it's important her kids learn how to handle all kinds of wildlife and what to stay away from. People are too sensitive and don't bother to ask why. They just think that I hurt my child intentionally, which I, if people that know me know that I would never hurt my children. Growing up, she learned how to handle reptiles going out on animal service calls with her father, a Jupiter police officer. Now she trusts her methods are teaching her children a valuable lesson. And she's not scared of snakes, but she doesn't want to touch them either. So that was my goal. In Highlands County, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.